Hey everyone, it's Cold Brew Gaming here with another Raid Shadow Legends videos, guys. And in this one, I'm just going to showcase blue stacks and how I use blue stacks in order to farm the champion training events so much easier and make my farming in the game so much easier. So what blue stacks is, guys, is basically an Android emulator where you can play your mobile phone games on your computer. So once you install blue stacks, basically have a mobile phone on your computer. As you can see right now, I have several games which I play and I have them on blue stacks. So Raid Shadow Legends is one of the games I play, obviously, because you're watching this video, guys. I'm going to show you how I use blue stacks for Raid. It's very easy. You just go to the Google Play Store and download Raid. You download Raid on blue stacks. You're going to go to the champion training event, for example, Example, you know you're gonna have to farm about 8,000 points 2,000 points every single day it's gonna take a lot of time it's gonna take a lot of resources what you want is to be the most efficient as possible with your resources what it really helps with blue stacks guys is the the macro feature I'm just gonna go quickly in a battle right now and show you how I use this macro feature usually my farmer guys takes about 10 seconds to farm and if he does not crit because I don't have him yet with 100% critical rate he does not crit uh, or does not do enough damage he won't clear it at the time I want which is about 8 to 10 seconds it usually takes 8 usually it takes 15 sometimes it might even take uh, 20 what I do is I want to have an auto clear that does a click every 25 seconds just to be on the safe side and just to not have an overlap of clicks that, that, that do not go to the replay button. I open up this button right here on the left, right here guys, it's called macro recorder. And what the macro recorder does is it's gonna help you uh, record an action in the game in blue stacks so in the bottom right here on the replay button just gonna press record new macro you're gonna click once or twice three times maybe and that's it guys you, you don't have to do anything else that was it you don't have to do anything else in terms of clicking you just do that simple action of pressing the replay button and then you go to settings and you're gonna set up your settings depending on what you want to farm you can see right here i've made several of these macros i have for one star two star three star and what this means is i've set it up so the macro repeats at 13 times using the champions that i have so if i have one stars and i want to level them up i have the macro repeat for a number of times i'm gonna show you what i have actually and then how you can set it up depending on what you want i have for one stars for example i'll open it up i have it repeat for three times because farming state uh, stage 12 three with one stars you're gonna need three runs with just the 100% XP boost going, you're just gonna need three runs to level them up to level 10. And level 10 is the maximum for, for rank one. So you put this repeat action for three times and then interval between executions. So every 25 seconds, as I said before, to be on the safe side and not waste any energy, I want this button to be repeated, the button click on the replay to be repeated every 25 seconds. Playback speed, you don't need to uh, change this at all. You don't need to, to change other settings at all. You don't need to do anything like this. And then you just press save and that's it. This is my farm one stars. The similar thing with farm two stars. To farm a two star to level 20, you need to repeat the fight 10 times. So this is what this macro does. It, it repeats it for 10 times. So farming three stars, you're just gonna need to repeat this action for 24 times. What the macro is gonna do is basically gonna repeat every 25 seconds, 24 times. So it's gonna farm your three star champions and then it's gonna stop. It's not gonna use any more energy. I'm gonna show you like live in action how this works. For the one stars, what I do, I put the foot in, <laughs> put the foot in. Before I press play, I open up the blue stacks macro recorder. I press start, continue, and then I immediately click the macro button. And now the macro is working right now on the top, in the top corner, you're gonna see running first time. So this is the first run. I'm not doing anything else. So you, you see how, how my fight delayed. So it took more than 15 seconds with the loading screens, with everything. And now right here, uh, so now the macro is running for the second time. It's doing again the fight. I'm trying to beat the final one in stage all three. There we go. And then the macro should repeat once more, go through the fight and then it's gonna stop. You see it stopped right now. It, it got out of the macro, um, macro sequence. So uh, you have the, the option again to select what you wanna do. So the fight is gonna finish up like usual. So I have food leveled up to level 10 and it's ready to be ranked up to uh, rank two. So what I also have is spam replay. This is just 
it simply repeats the action indefinitely until stop so if i want to farm dungeons and i'm actually on the computer doing something else and i just put this and it's gonna farm dungeons until i'm bored i don't want to repeat it uh, uh, for example 10 times i want to do dungeons until i finish what i'm doing and you can put blue stacks on the side do something else play another game and another example of using the script is i could use this instead to farm minotaur uh, minotaur if you if you can farm minotaur 15 on average it takes about 155 to 160 runs depending on how lucky you are but on average it's 155 so i i would do this i would put 155 times to repeat the click for on the replay button and then i would I would put here the interval between executions depending on how fast you can farm the um the dungeon being the minotaur for me i think the longest i can take is two minutes for to clear it and the shortest is 40 seconds so i'm not gonna put 40 seconds there i'm gonna put the longest time that i need to farm minotaur plus uh, some time for the loading screens between each round and the boss and the actions of the, the player the champions do once they kill the boss so i'm gonna put two two minutes and 30 seconds this is gonna repeat for 155 times and that's it guys we can actually put something uh, here like other settings after 60 minutes restart blue stacks you don't need to do this because you're just gonna have the macro repeat for 155 times and once you click save that's it. You don't need to do anything else. You can change the name right here. Mino Farm. Click the save button. That's it, guys. So you go in the Minotaur, you immediately start the, the fight, press Mino Farm, and you can do whatever else you want. Once this finishes, you're gonna have full masteries on average because 155 times it's on average. So you might take more, it might take less. It won't farm more than the time that you actually place in the settings. So guys, if you like this video, leave a like down below, comment if you downloaded the uh, blue stacks through my description and actually use the macro recorder. If you need any help, leave a comment down below. Of course, subscribe to my channel for more Raid Shadow Legends videos. And of course, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.